Where were you born? Atlanta, Georgia, Grady Hospital. And raised in Atlanta as well? Mm-hmm. And still reside in Atlanta today? Mm-hmm. Now, is it a certain part of Atlanta you represent? I mean, like, I don't just going around, I don't just go around saying, oh, I'm from, you know what I'm saying, I'm from the west side, I'm from, but if somebody asks me where I'm from, I'd be like, yeah, I'm from the west side of Atlanta. They'd be like, well, on the west side, I'd be like, I'm from Bankhead Courts. So, yeah, but I don't just, you know, just be out ripping, like, nah. Now, when it comes to Atlanta, what do people get wrong about ATL? Is it something people say, but it's not true? Um, I mean, I don't really hear nobody saying nothing that's, I don't really, you know, hear nobody saying this, something that's not true about Atlanta. Like, they don't say nothing bad. They don't really say nothing bad about Atlanta. A lot of people have good stuff to say about Atlanta. Like, we the most litest, we the litest city. Like, we're, we're lit. Everybody come to Atlanta to get shit done. So, I feel like I don't, Ain't nothing really to bad, bad say about Atlanta. Like, besides our fucked up traffic. And we got some gay niggas in Atlanta. That's probably true. Like, yeah, we got some gay niggas in Atlanta. But yeah, that's about it. Now, when it comes to ATL, best thing about Atlanta, in your opinion, out of all the characteristics that, um, may, that there may be, best thing about Atlanta? I feel like opinion. we the best, like, um, like, we the turn up city, like, you gonna come to Atlanta, you gonna have a good time, and you gonna go home and talk about it, and you gonna wanna come back. You might not even leave when you get down here. So I feel like we the turn up city. On the opposite end of the spectrum, worst thing about Atlanta, if any? Um, a lot of gay niggas. Like, it's a lot of gay niggas. Like, you can't even have a nigga without thinking that some gay shit going on, because a lot of niggas are gay. And they be so down low with it, like you would never know what they are. I ain't saying everybody, but I'm just saying most people are. Now, has that happened to you? Have you been in a relationship with someone and I ain't never been with I ain't never been with nobody and I don't find out that it was gay or they had some gay shit going on. But these niggas so sneaky, you never know what they got going on. But I never like caught somebody that I was with, like doing some gay shit or, you know, then did some gay shit. For time reference, it's September 2021 now, but who is the spokesperson at, of Atlanta, if there is one? Um, I feel like Lil Baby. I feel like Lil Baby and Young Thug. Like, I feel like they both got the city on lock, like, especially Lil Baby. I feel like Lil Baby. Thug, too, both of them. Lil Baby and Thug. Anything you would say to someone watching this about to visit Atlanta for the very first time? Um, They've heard about it, haven't experienced it yet, but they're about to. Anything you would tell them? They're going to have to see for themselves. Like, it's not really nothing I can tell them besides. You're just going to have to come. It's a situation where you're just going to have to come see for yourself. Now, generally speaking, how does one stay safe visiting Atlanta? You need to keep a scrap on you because if you come up here with that rah rah shit and you talking out the side of your neck and you ain't got no gun, ain't anything bound to happen to you. So you need to come on go and you know what I'm saying? Be ready for everything, anything. Anything come your way, you gotta be ready for it. That's it. Anything else you wanna mention about Lana or a question I didn't ask people wanna know about it? Um, no, ain't nothing, nothing.